What is disparaging language about health care or about a medical provider? What is the definition of disparaging comments or derogatory language about a medical provider or our medical system? If a medical provider misdiagnoses me for years and I suffer and suffer or harms me with medication. One medication I was put on and I said, we have to stop, stop raising the dose. I'm going to rip. I'm going to rip. And I ripped in four places. My body ripped four hernias. Doctor just wouldn't listen. If things remain undiagnosed for years and years, if I'm injured from a medication and almost killed, if I'm struggling to breathe from medications, if I'm injured from a surgery and it's covered up, if I'm injured from a medication and it's all covered up and I'm being threatened. But if I speak about it, I'm the bad guy. I'm put on a, a third benzodiazepine. Benzodiazepines are powerful drugs. I had to wean off of all medications to fight for health care. A doctor put me on a third benzodiazepine indefinitely. That is not, not right and not okay. And everybody watched. All, tons, dozens of doctors saw this. The medications I was on, nobody would speak up. And then they would put me on an opioid or gabapentin, and I'm struggling to breathe, and nobody will help me. Me talking like this is this. disparaging language? Is this derogatory language? Am I the bad guy? Two medications I started weaning off of, literally, literally no doctor anywhere knew how to get me off the medications alive. I was stopping breathing during the daytime here by myself. Nobody knew how to help me. All sorts of complex medical issues, and I was being threatened. I was threatened two times by two different doctors. Nobody knew how to get me off these medications, and like 25% of you are, are on one of these medications. Nobody knew how to get me off this medication alive. But if I talk about it, I'm the bad guy. I'm the perpetrator. If I talk about I walked out of an epidural and I had nerve damage from the neck on down, I'm the bad guy. All of that was covered up. If I woke up during a surgery and I stopped breathing in their care and they tossed me out onto the street like that, sent me home with a bottle of opioids in my hands, I'm the bad guy for telling you, and I am the perpetrator. We have to decide what our definitions actually mean. If, I, if I'm extremely physically injured and traumatized, severely psychologically traumatized because of medical like this, then I must be the problem. <laughs>